Okay, well, today my baby's got a new toy. My niece bought uh, the baby's a new toy. So she's excited. She can't wait. You wait, no toy? You want your toy? Are you ready? Let's do it that way. You ready? Go get it. She loves to play fetch. Uh, she just quite hasn't learned how to bring it back and drop it to me. She drops it at a distance still. So she'll learn. But come on, baby. Bring it here, baby. A little closer, baby. Come here. Come here. Good girl. Okay, right there's good. I'll throw it again. You ready? Are you ready? Throw that on there. Are you ready? Here we go. And there it goes. <laughs> she loves to play. <laughs> she just loves to play. She's a cutie. Come here, Molly. Come here, booby. Oh, that's a good girl. Okay. I'll get it, girl. Hold on. Are you ready? Yeah, my niece bought this toy today. My other niece today, she went to get a new cast. It's kind of like a slinger, whatever. I'll show you later. She got it put on today, so they stopped in there because uh, my niece's dog, you saw her in one of the other videos. Well, she has three of her own dogs, big dogs. So she bought her her dog a new treat or like new toy like this. And then she figured uh, Molly would like one. My angel, well, she's too busy chasing rabbits out here somewhere. I'm not sure where she is. Angel, where'd you go, baby? I'm not sure where Angel is. She took off somewhere too. Are you ready, Molly? Are you ready? There it goes. She just runs like crazy. She just loves it. But it tires her out. It'll make her less restless in the house too, out here playing. We usually just throw a stick. But she likes balls. She likes to play the balls. So we can play for hours out here. But it's a little chilly, so my other one's going to want to win soon. It's like minus 14 today, so. All right, baby. Are you ready? There you go, right to ya. <laughs> you caught that one, didn't ya? You caught it, didn't ya, baby? <laughs> oh, the god, baby. Get it. <laughs> good girl. Good girl, baby. That a good girl. Okay, you ready? We do it again. Are you ready? I'm gonna throw it. It's gonna go far. Are you ready? And there it goes. <laughs> Look at her go. Just loves to play. Don't you, baby girl? <laughs> she can play for hours out here. We have with sticks and stuff. When it gets warmer, she'll be out here with me all the time. I wouldn't even put her in the house. She'll be outside 24-7 almost, except for at night. Okay, you ready, baby? Are you ready? <gasps> there you go! <laughs> she caught that one. She's good at playing that. It's cold out here. Winds, it's a little windy today, so it's made it a little bit colder than normal. The sun was out. Uh, I just today mostly did most of my running around and stuff. I had some other errands and stuff to do today. Um, didn't really uh, do any work on scrap today. I uh, stuck around the house and did some uh, running around in the city because I don't live in the city, so I'm out in the country, so I'm out where. Nobody gives me any hassle. My neighbors are great. The only time I see them is when they come and drop me scrap off. I got really nice at neighbors. We've lived here a long time though. So we've gotten along with our neighbors a long time. We've seen that, you know, it's been the same neighbors. There she goes. <laughs> All right, girl, I think I'm gonna go fill up the stove up. I'm gonna go fill the stove up. I gotta go fill the stove. Bring it, bring it, bring your ball. We'll go check the stove. I threw a skid in it because I hadn't put much in it all day. So I'm going to go check it right now. And as you can see, all those skids I had here that was all cut, there's only one left that I get it cut, and that was two there. Uh, there's not much left. I've only got a few skids left, so I'm going to have to get another couple more loads and bring them in. See, so you can see it's just starting to catch again. But. I'm going to throw some of that other wood in here on top that's here. So that's what I'm going to be doing in a few minutes here. I'm probably going to have to split some wood tomorrow. What's left of these big blocks. I'll probably put them on the splitter and split them up. So these ones here, these ones are too big for me to throw them in. That one here is too big, but this one's okay. I can throw this one in. Uh, too big, way too big, too big. So that'll be tomorrow. Between that and, I don't know, maybe I'll be back at the barn, clean some more scrap. There's always something to do around here. 
So I got some more over here I gotta split up under the snow. I don't know where my angel went. I'll have to call her in a few minutes because she'll probably be freezing. Her paws were hurting her. Don't know where she went. She's probably chasing a rabbit. She does that. But anyhow, I see <laughs> she's over there. Molly is. She wants me to come play with her. But I'm just kind of waiting for this to catch and then I'm going to throw a bunch of more stuff in on it. So it smells good because uh, most of these skids are pine, so it smells really nice when they burn. When you're out here so i just leave the door open for it to catch a little more draft because it has i threw a bunch of it this morning but it burned off so now i'm just going to restart it up again and it's already the it's humming so it means it needs to go back up the temperature does so so i'll throw a bunch of stuff in it and get it going it'll be uh, it's throwing lots of heat in the house it's just calling for it because it needs more heat in the house it's a big house to heat and i'm glad we don't have to heat it with oil and stuff i remember when we did and it was you know five six hundred dollars a month just didn't just in oil and when i put this in this outside furnace in i mean all we pay now is our our hydro that's it so and it and actually this stove heats our hot water tank too heats the water in it too it's hooked up to it so we don't have to worry about hydro having to do that which is nice i have it i started in the in the summer too with the outside furnace and it heats my hot water because i don't flip it over so what we use for air conditioning extra hydro I save in my um, hot water tank heating so and you don't have to light it that often as long as the water's hot it just you know it's great so and like I said that's why I cut a lot of skids up and stuff but it helps a lot so but all right well I'm going to uh, get at this and get it done some Christmas lights somebody brought in I think they threw them off there I think they work someone said but I'm not worrying about them I'll probably pick them up and throw them in the uh, Christmas lights collection. I think there's a bin full of them somewhere around here. All right, well, I guess, and it's, like I said, it's pretty chilly out here. It's a chilly day. We still got snow on the ground here. They're calling for more snow here in Ontario, well, my area anyhow, which is, uh, I'm about, uh, what, three, three and a half hours to Toronto and about two Two hours to Ottawa so I'm right in the middle which is Kingston so and I'm on the outskirts of that so but I got lots of land for the animals to run on it used to be a working farm at one time but uh, we don't uh, do that anymore but my niece wants to get back into animals and stuff I just kicked it so she chased it she just loves to play but uh, yeah I'm not really I mean I did enough of it when I was a kid don't really care to do it now so but anyhow, I'm going to sign off now, and uh, I hope you liked the video. Uh, now I got it going. Look at her burning now. She's toasty now. Anybody likes that snap, crackle, pop? There's some nice pine going up. That's what I like about the skids. You throw them in there, and your fire's going good, and you got the hot coals in the bottom from the skids, and that wood there will burn up. So, I'll be out later probably to fill up. I just threw this little bit in now to get it going. Then again, I might just fill it up right now before dark. I don't want to worry about it. I'm getting there. I got a few more here. I got through and out. These smaller ones I'm going to throw all in. So, it's burning nice. That's what I like. I just feel the heat coming off it. It'll burn the temperature. It'll bring the temperature of the water up too. So, Having the door open like this for now, which is good for me. I don't mind. I don't mind the heat coming off it. Feels good. I put the puppies inside because it was cold for them. So now that the Molly didn't want to go in, she wants to stay and play with the ball. But hopefully it's a little warmer. I think we're, they're calling for snow. I think either tomorrow or the next day here. So we'll see what the weather is when I get up tomorrow. I might uh, come out and play out the puppy again and maybe work on the bar and defense. I may not go anywhere. Today, like I said, I had a lot of running around to do, so I got all that done. Next thing I want to do is I got to go and uh, I'm going to go price some tools that I want, so I do love the feel of that. I can sit here for hours and watch it and the feel, the heat off it. So nice. Nice and warm.
Okay, so she went and got a new one because it was rubbing here. Because um, her foot was swelled so bad, now the swelling had went down. So what happened, they had crunched her toes together, so she had to go and get a new one because her foot was swelled so bad. So she got that today. Um, she goes back in, what, one week? Monday. Wee! She goes back on Monday, and she gets the staples out of here. I'd show you the pictures, but it's really gross, and if you got a weak stomach for that kind of thing, it's probably not wise for me to put it on there, so I'm not going to put it in my videos. Um, and my baby's trying to get up there. You be careful. You don't hurt her foot, booby. You be careful, booby. She's so cute. <laughs> she is. You're so cute. You're so cute, booby. Yes. Went from bad foot to a cutie pie. <laughs> and there's the other cutie pie. They just can't get enough, both of them. But anyhow, yeah, so she's still mending. She's got four to six weeks. So, well, there it is. So, Hope these guys liked my video today. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. And if you're uh, new to my ch channel, then uh, please subscribe to it. Thank you.